2020 Nautique GS20. This boat's in a Victory Red upper and lower deck stripe, Victory Red main stripe, and then Mystic White hull accent, hull bottom, and forward stripe. Sitting on a Mystic White tandem axle boatmate trailer with spare tire and bow ladder. Updates for 2020 include the new windshield we're looking at. More of a frameless design. Gives it definitely a more modern look to the boat. And we have 35% window tint on there. Up top, we've got an onyx black tower. A set of rotating board racks. JL 8.8 .8 tower speakers in Nautique Bimini with surf pockets. Well, this is a really cool looking boat looks really slick on the water too We've got some water video to check out if you haven't seen that yet um, transom we've got the victory red platform surf pipe and nss equipped on here the white nss covers and the trailer's got these steps and transom straps as well um, black Chromax, so we got the black vents here on the sides and the black lettering to go along with that. A really sharp looking boat. I'm a big fan of red, so I think this thing looks pretty darn good. But we'll get one more look on the outside and then we'll hop inside and check out the interior features of this GS20. Let's step in. On the transom, we've got the rear seats on either side with the step in the middle with the C-deck step. <clears throat> and then we have kind of these little paths around the sun pad as well. So you can avoid walking on the vinyl as much as possible. Interior vinyl, we've got Mystic White Main with Onyx Black seat boxing and piping. And then red accents and stitching. Really clean interior on this. Um, walking down into the inside, you've got the nice step. There is a removable seat cushion that you can put in there if you'd like. <clears throat> in the walkthrough, this has the pop-up ski pylon. Let's check out our storage. On either side of the engine, you've got these nice deep storage compartments. It's all 1,850 pounds of ballast. The subfloor on the GS20. So we got life jackets and the boat cover, as you can see, on either side now. <coughs> Excuse me. And that will remain the same whether you've got full ballast or not. Drivetrain is the ZR4 from PCM. Is now fully closed loop cooling, so you can see that big coolant reservoir in the back and the heat exchanger on the other side. But still 409 horsepower, same performance, just a different cooling system for 2020 on all the boats. Gray sea deck, titanium sea deck rather, all through the interior of the boat. A minor change for 20 on all of our GS boats is they've added some cool accent stitching. So just gives the boat that really premium look. You can see that in a handful of different areas inside the boat. Um, checking out the storage here. We've got the trash can. We've got our speaker covers for those 8.8 .8 JLs up top inside there. And then a new cooler for 2020 from Nautique. It's more of an insulated, thicker style cooler. <clears throat> and then if you take that out, you do have communicating storage to the back. Got enhanced courtesy lighting in here, set to red currently to match. Um, but with that, you, all the cup holders in the main cockpit are uh, colored as well as the Nautique backlit logo on the driver's seat. And then any courtesy lights you have in the boat. This is equipped with six JL 
interior speakers, a subwoofer, which we'll see in a moment, along with those two speakers up top on the tower. We've got communicating storage, fully c deck lined, and everything's hinged. So it's self-supporting when you're loading your equipment in and out of the storage compartments. We've got dual batteries under here. And let's check out under the love seat. See that amp we were just talking about? Um, or the sub rather, and the amps above. There's the seat cushion for the back center where the step is. We also have the air dam option on here. And speaking of climate features, we've got a heated love seat, which you access in the glove box on the left there. And we have heated, uh, so heated drivers and love seat. And then we also have the heater option on here that has the defroster up top on the dash and then a heater outlet. Well, actually two heater outlets at the driver's feet that you can pop out and extend across the main cockpit of the boat. Let's make our way over to the dash. We've got our nice bolstered driver's seat. Super high seat back for support if you do bolster up. <clears throat> As I sit down here, you'll see nothing blocking your view out of the windshield on this GS20. Tons of visibility. Screen set down really nice and low and to the right of your <coughs> excuse me steering wheel. Um, on the left we have phone holder, chargers, cubby for whatever gear you bring along. <coughs> excuse me guys, should have brought some water. Um, we have red stitching, link fan array screen, and helm command over here. Also have the upgraded steering wheel and hand wrapped leather. Got the oversized mirror. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice, guys. <coughs> and then nice open bow on the GS20. Speakers, cup holders, storage under all the seats up front. But we'll come with the fenders as well. You've got Fender Pro clips to attach to those. And C deck all around the gunnels of the boat, just like we did in the back. Sorry, I'm losing my voice. I'm going to cut this short. I think I've covered pretty much everything, and I don't want to burst anybody's eardrums with coughing. So call us at N3 Boatworks with any questions you might have on this beautiful GS20. Thanks for watching.